The Boughton Street neighborhood now has a playground it can literally call its own. Yeah, this is the best one we had in a long time. Literally because they helped build it. For most of the past week, corporate volunteers and members of the community raised the equipment and on Saturday the playground officially opened. The park needs to be used correctly. You know, the eyes and ears have to be the neighbors and that's what we're encouraging and it looks like that that's what's happening. Sponsors including Pepperidge Farm and GE Capital provided the money. In June, local children provided input on what the playground should look like. Then neighbors like Deron Sanders provided some elbow grease. It's good because the last one was, it wasn't so good. You know, it was small, the kids, a lot of kids couldn't come over and play. Now it's better for everybody. Because of the work uh, that the city and the businesses and we've been able to be a part of, I think it's going to be a real benefit to the whole neighborhood and the whole community. We reactivated the spotlights that shine on the park. So there's a little, uh, it's much brighter so that the police could see any activity. We hope that that'll mean that the park will stay cleaner and be more useful and uh, there'll be a, a pride about this uh, Bowton Park because of their engagement in it. The project cost about $88,000. Sponsors provided over $86,000, which means the city is only on the hook for 2,500 bucks. We didn't have to pay for installation, so installation was part of the community build. So it really turned out unbelievable. Mike Peel, it's relevant.com.